What's up, guys? May 21st, 10 o'clock. I uh, figure it's about time to put another video out here. Uh, I've tried to do this two nights ago, and I pulled up a bunch of webcams on the All Sky Cam Network and found some pretty crazy things. I also wanted to go over a couple pictures that I got sent in to me. Uh, first one is this guy. I'm not sure where it was taken. But this is very similar to what we've seen in Australia and off of the webcam in North Carolina. If you haven't seen those, check out my previous videos. You can see those guys. Um, the other one was this one, which is obviously some kind of a reflection, I would guess. But it's very strange in the clouds. Um, there's a few pictures of it. Very different. Uh don't really know how to explain it or what it is but thought it was pretty cool uh, let's go to the the webcams now this was two nights ago I'd planned on doing this then but had a couple of kids that were sick so that didn't really work out uh, this one here is in in Texas um, as you can see local time is it starts off at about 1129 uh, What's strange, you can see this light coming from down here in the southwest, but at 1129, it gets super bright. Very weird. And what even makes it stranger is here in, in Texas, we've got another webcam that's doing the same exact thing at almost the same exact time. Uh, if anybody's there and can tell me what's going on with that, that'd be kind of interesting to find out. I'm um, just going to refresh these now, two days later, see what they look like. Let's see what this does here. And apparently they haven't changed it. They've got it on a loop there. And this one, let's try this. No change. Interesting. Now next we're going to go to, uh, this came in Sweden. If you watch the WSO network with Steve Olson, they've been showing some pictures like this, wondering if it's, it's raindrops or they're capturing a large planet this one here in Sweden obviously this is raindrops I mean you can you can see them running down it's rain now just for fun let's refresh it same thing now this one here is a little different this one's in Canada and what's really strange about this is if we stop it right here on this frame look at that guys that is very weird very strange um, we can go in and zoom on that a little bit and what we see I don't know what we see it looks like the shape of a planet Again, it does look like raindrops, but I just don't know. Uh, move on down here. Let's go back to original size. This one here was kind of interesting. Um, what I've been seeing is some, some strange things. Look here, rising. Seeming like a large object. Maybe not. Uh, what I've also been seeing in a lot of these cams is that the clouds, look at that, seem to be being pushed in a direction by something. I don't really know how to explain that. That's strange. Um, I don't know. Maybe somebody else has some some information on that. Uh, then we go back here to Australia. This should be sunrise, rising in the east. And what's kind of strange is here on this frame, you can see, I guess, the sun starting to come up here. Some strange light coming from this area. But we let it go one more frame, and boom, there is some really red light coming from down here in the south and as soon as they get to that frame it goes away kind of suspicious 
Um, this is all webcams here. That's what I'm going to do on this video. This here is in San Francisco, which I've seen some strange things there already before. But you can see down here in the south, um, this is almost midnight in Pacific time, that you get a sudden bright light. You can kind of almost see it coming in. Um, don't have an explanation for that either. I just thought it was very odd, very strange. Look at that. Now right before that, you can see it kind of lights up here to the north, going to the south. Uh, just another interesting, strange thing from these webcams. Uh, here in Chile, this is nighttime, of course. All of these were done at night. And we've all been seeing the halo during the day. But this is the coolest, strangest halo I've seen at night. Look at that. So why is the moon having a halo? Don't quite understand that at all. Um, let's see if we can go back to the home. Let's see if we can find this thing now. Chili. This is live. I'm one take. I don't have editing capabilities, so bear with me for just a second. There it is. No halo today. Very strange. Now this is kind of weird here. What is this object? Why is it moving this way? That's bizarre. Anyway, let's move on. This was the, a Texas observatory. And I paused it. Not only is there, you know, I'm guessing this is the moon. There's also some really bright light here. Uh, see how it looks when it's moving. And like I was talking about earlier, it, it seems like the clouds are being pushed up from here. Kind of weird. And uh, now here in Florida, we're seeing that same that same object looking thing here over the moon. Is it a reflection? Don't know, but it sure is the same thing as we're seeing here. Look, there's the two objects. We go here to Florida. Look, same two objects. I don't know. Um, one more here. Like I said, this was two days ago. Not sure exactly what we were looking at on this guy. Um, not sure. We'll skip that. Here's the Texas thing again. Really strange light up sky. This here in in England. Look here in the east at. The sun has went down here in the west. You can see it going down. What is this red cloud and lighting up here? That really corroborates with what we've seen in my last video. The sunset in Mexico lighting up in the east. One that goes down in the west. I uh, didn't get to see this go any higher. I wish I would have. So that I could see if this light rises like it did in the Mexican one. Uh, in Cancun. Also notice all the... It looks like Kim trailing going on through the sky. Uh, not surprising. That's that's what these guys do. They try to cover things up. It makes sense that you're seeing something there. That's that's probably the most interesting uh, red cloud I've seen. Uh, this one just looked kind of crazy. I think they just need to clean this camera. I don't know why there's so much light here in the south when the sun's rising. Maybe that's just a reflection off this dirty dirty camera. 
And finally, uh, the big planet theory, which we heard uh, on the WSO channel also from Samuel Hoffman. I thought this video was showing something pretty interesting. Uh, he was talking about changes in colors of blue meant that there were big objects in the background. And we see that here with the light blue and the dark blue in the shape of a planet. Um, we don't know if that's true or not, but I just thought it was kind of cool. Uh, the last thing I want to talk about is this Someone's Bones article that with this supposed Dr. Ronald Shimshuk. Uh, he's saying he's a top uh, physicist astrophysicist that that's coming out to talk about the planet um, kind of skeptical on this I know nothing about this site but um, seems pretty interesting I just watched Steve Olson's latest video today and he's gonna try to have this guy on the show so I'm really interested to see what uh, what this guy has to say uh, according to the article he's saying that you know astronomers are scared to come out with this stuff uh, they don't want to speak about it and that he's thinking you know September area for it to come uh, I guess we'll have to see um, not my vi my most action-packed informational video I've put out but uh thought it was kind of interesting haven't put one out in a while so I wanted to get something out here for you guys to check out uh, if you got any good pictures feel free to send them to me I'll leave the link below to my email uh, stay safe. Pay attention to what's going on around you guys.